While I'm waiting for my laminate to arrive to make my new top, I made these little uh, magic fingers, they call them. And so now instead of using a pencil to hold small parts, I can use this, which is much more substantial. Uh, I, made, I made four of them, two for me and a couple for my son, but you can also use them like this to hold small parts, you know, at the chop saw even. Um, get a spacer block out here say your cut your saw cut is going to be there you can hold it like that and that that uh, can, can get your basically what your finger would be right next to the blade rather than you and using your actual finger or like this you can see they're well cushioned so they're going to come in handy let me show you how I made them Find approximate center. Locate it. Drill a hole. Thread it. They, they send you this piece of threaded rod, by the way, which works out really nice. Take the rubber foot, and they give you these plastic uh, threaded screws. Which is good because you don't want metal next to your blade at, at all. And then simply just thread it in the hole. And that's it. This is where you can buy those rubber feet, by the way. <laughs>